What is up, y'all? It is your boy Wee Peeler in the house, back with some more Clash of Clans on my channel. But before we start the video, an absolute massive thank you goes out to you guys for the support on the first video. It was unexpected. I did not see that coming. Thank you so much. It's humbling. And here we are with some more Clash. Now, moving forward, though, my main clan is Clanimals. I'm trying to keep it a little bit tight knit. I appreciate you guys jumping in. Had about 30 or 40 people join. And I am unfortunately going to start kicking people. We are going to do an audition the next few wars. We're looking for about two or three more decent players so donate make sure you get some stars in the wars and you guys can make the cut for the last few but good news is coming i will be starting a starting from scratch or a let's play clash of clans where i start at a town hall level one and move my way up i will definitely start another clan and you guys are free to join and we'll have some hella fun so gonna show you some war highlights from my last war we actually won 25 to 5 it was a absolute drubbing these guys were just no good here's me attacking a town hall level eight pretty decently maxed out his walls were not that good he did have some decent air defenses though so i dropped the lightning on the bottom and then moved my way over hoping the dragons would be smart enough to take out both air defenses but as you will see unfortunately they only got to the one on the top left and the top right one kind of hindered my three star but we still did good nonetheless but moving forward like i said i will be starting another clan you guys are free to join and we're gonna see where we go from there just have some fun everyone donate and have a good old time but for my main one, the clan animals that I'm in right now, it's actually not even my clan. My buddy started it. We've been friends since the sixth grade. And he's a good dude, man. He just absolutely knows what he's doing in this game. He's actually molded me into the player that I am now. I'm not the best player in the world by any means. I can hold my own. I've learned a lot in the last few months. But I still don't feel like I should be the leader of that clan. So, friends of P, it's on you, man. You are the man. I will show a raid from him after this one. He just moved up to a Town Hall 9, and he's really, really decent. So, going to check that raid out in a little bit. But here we are. We're going to speed this up a little bit, show you my Barb King and my lone dragon trying to take out the rest of this base. It just did not work. That last air defense was my demise, unfortunately. But we did pretty good. We were able to get almost the complete three-star. I think it was 86%, so that's not a bad raid, especially at the higher levels when you're up in the uh, Town Hall 8s max and then Town Hall 9s. If you can get a two-star, you're pretty good. The Town Hall 9 actually gives you an extra speed spell in the Archer Queen, which helps immensely in raids, as you will see here. He's attacking a Town Hall level 8, nearly maxed out, and he's working his way in with some lightning spells and a few dragons, and he's able to take out the entire base and get a 3-star as he drops his Archer Queen near the end. So you guys are going to check that out. His raid, though, is actually really good, and uh, he dropped the, the 3 lightnings right away, and I forgot that he had an extra heal spell, which really came into play and really was able to get him 3-star. I was completely unaware of it. I was watching live. I'm like, damn, he already used all his spells. There's no way he's going to get this. But as he moves on to the town hall, there is the heal spell. Heals up most of his dragons, and he's able to just absolutely just decimate this base. So good raid, friends of P. You are the leader. Hats off to you. Take a boo, son. And uh, moving on, though, I think... I think I'm going to be starting starting from scratch pretty soon. I, it's going to take me a long time to get anywhere near where I'm at right now. Like I said before, I started playing this game in February. And here we are, end of August, and I'm only still Town Hall 8, moving up to a Town Hall 9. So here is my war base. Like I showed, or like I told you guys last episode, I would show you. Town Hall is locked and loaded in between some level 8 skull cap walls. Looking pretty good. These L's right here with mortars, air defenses, cannons, and archers just deter people they don't want to attack me the only downfall here is my clan castle can get let out or lured out a little bit on the edges right there but overall last three wars no one's even attacked me they look at this base and they're like screw that if i looked at that base i would not be the one that i would want to attack these air defenses make it very difficult for anything to get in you've got to take out a whole corner of the base before you can even get to one air defense so i'm liking this one feel free to use it if you guys want to in your war and uh, hopefully it works well for you it's worked well for me so uh do an a few little upgrades before we get to a town hall level nine if you guys missed my base it's actually in the last episode and actually right at the end here here is my farming base everything is pretty much upgraded we are working on some walls and hopefully we can get most of those done before we get up to town hall level nine working on getting some resources so we can bang out the archer queen as soon as we get there and then probably going to work on the army camp so that we have 220 troops instead of 200 definitely going to help out in the future so again thank you guys for the support it's been absolutely immense i cannot believe it i cannot thank you guys enough i really really do appreciate the support and i'll catch you guys next time peace